Yes, well my name is Stephen Crockford. I'm the Curriculum Manager for Engineering here at uh, North Kent College. I've been with the college a number of years, um, both as a technician, lecturer and Curriculum Manager. I do have some industrial experience in TV video engineering uh, in the past. Well the area that I, I, my, I cover is uh, mechanical manufacturing and electrical electronic engineering run by two exam boards, the BTEC Pearson exam board and the EAL exam board. They differ in terms of the type of vocational qualifications that we offer. We offer both technical qualifications at BTEC that can progress to university level and EAL qualifications that move a individual towards a craft based um, job um, requirement, um, but the BTEC uh, qualifications also prepare students for industry as well. My name is Finlay, uh, I'm on my third year of Level 3 Engineering. My name is Kean Hunter, this is my first year in, uh, on this Engineering uh, Extended Certificate course. It varies day to day really, I can be up in um, a classroom doing my theory work or I can be down here in the workshop doing a practical lesson. You know, with various, to be honest, a really good mix of both, because it contains such a big syllabus across the course. You know, I'm either working on something physical, you know, or in theory aspect. I chose college um, over sixth form because it was a one year course, and I feel like I'd like to actually go into the job sort of aspect uh, after college. So um, I'd prefer to have more of a work environment um, after just doing one year instead of being doing two years at uh, school, at sixth form. I chose to go to college because I see myself as a very practical person. I, I wasn't a very big fan of sort of all the sitting down paper writing homework kind of stuff. I like to sort of get in there, you know, and get, get active with things. Well, the facilities that are up here are more or less a clean area. So we have CAD electronic laboratories here. Down in the mechanical workshop, we have a, a, a purpose-built welding area where students can weld um, metals and we also have a workshop for them to complete turning, milling and use CNC software on a lot of mechanical aspects. Uh, the equipment that we use um, can be uh, on the computers as well, so, so multi-SIM, CAD, etc. Um, the tutors uh, are helpful and knowledgeable, so it's good to learn off that. And I'm particularly pleased with our employer links. We have at the moment um, a company, uh, BAE Systems, who have an establishment at Rochester who have sent a, quite a large number of students to us on a HE program, HNC program, which full time students naturally progress to uh, upon completing the Level 3 BTEC qualification with us. So, as well as BAE sy Systems, we have BBA Remen, Thames Water, a lot of the ex-utilities that send students to us and we've had quite a large good track record in, in moving students to employment opportunities and those employment opportunities have been very, very successful in, in moving students to those jobs and returning them on day release programmes with us. The two distinct pathways are a BTEC pathway and an EAL qualification pathway. Both pathways lead to employment in engineering, but carrying out a two distinctly different roles in an engineering vocation. One is more technical, one is more akin to the design engineer, which is BTEC, where the EAL qualification tends to be more craftsman, tends to be more maintenance and servicing operative in, in a particular company. The BTEC qualifications can also offer university opportunities for a student after two years of study for which we offer a national diploma qualification in engineering and the university links that we have are also bridged by our higher national certificate which students can go on before they do enter a degree level at, at stage two. Uh, with BA Systems we have a number of students who have gone on to um, very good opportunities with a company at Rochester where they are test technicians working in the electrical electronic division and I'm pleased to say that they have been very impressive in terms of their performance so much so that uh, BA Systems have moved their HE provision, their HE requirements to us from another local provider so I think it bodes well with what we're producing in terms of a, a student after the BTEC qualification. I mean if it wasn't for the college I wouldn't be on the placement, I wouldn't have the interest that I have in you know, the trade industry and in engineering. 
I'd, I'd say give it a go. It, you know, it never hurts. You know, do, you know, trying it out. You can do it. You can do a year in one thing. Get that experience. It may not be, you know, for you. But now you know that it is really good to sort of try and see what's out there instead of, you know, I might not do it. I might do it. Uh, I would say go for the specified course on what you want to do. So um, whether it even whether it's just one year, as long as it's specialised to what you want to do, such as engineering. For me, um, I feel like they should go for that course. We pride ourselves in supporting students when they're with us and if you are a year 11 student we you know, encourage you to make an application with us which will move to an interview situation and upon completing a successful interview the place that you'll get with us you will be supported during your time here with us and we have a very sound track record a very good record in terms of those students who have passed and have gone on to very good employment opportunities for the past 20-25 years since I've, since I've been here. Apply online for the, one of the engineering programs. We look forward to your seeing your application and moving you to, to an interview situation.